every time you touch me. I can't really? Yeah. Hey everybody, welcome to the Sweat Corner. For those joining us for the very first time, welcome you all. Welcome. Today I have guests. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Blue, a aka Sar. <laughs> you can choose which one you want to call me. Hi, I'm Nanda. We are coming to you in like we are at home, guys. It's just let's just get that in order already. But we bought new drinks, and so we're taking it a bit away from like makeup and stuff for the for to, this episode. And yeah, I brought my sisters in. We're doing some tasters. Okay. Anyway, so we discovered in one of our shopping random mall walking stuff that um, Fourth Street has new flavors. Yes, and new packaging as well. So we're tasting those. So for today's taste tester, we're gonna taste these three Fourth Street flavors. Okay, I am holding the Fourth Street Rockin' Raspberry flavor, alcohol in grape, and the bev it is like 4.5 alcohol, the 440 ml. I don't know if you have seen this. This is one of the flavors we'll taste. Each person will go with theirs. Go. Ah. I'm holding the 4th Street Wild Cola flavor. I don't know if you can see that properly. Uh, but yeah, it's a flavored drink. I'm assuming they spiced up the wines and put it, bottled it differently in a can. Easy for easy consumption, clearly. <laughs> Yours, Nanda? Okay, mine is Cool Botanical. As you can see them, got some alcoholic grip alcoholic mm. grip okay. yeah yeah mine is raspberry yeah. and lychee fl flavor if you check at the back here yeah, they give you extra stuff in there as well so oh. mine is raspberry oh. and lychee flavor and this one is vanilla and cola flavor oh uh -huh. Yours? mine is cucumber and oh but what's the cucumber juniper? and juniper botanicals mm. wow okay very flowery okay. so those are our flavors yes uh, it has 4.5% uh, volume of alcohol, just so you know. So it's just just below beer. <laughs> <laughs> yep. The, the first, if, well, everybody who knows the Fourth Street brand, Fourth Street is actually a wine company, and they make a variety of wines. The most popular yeah. one, I guess, in our country is the sweet, the rosé. The rosé. Uh, Fourth Street sweet, sweet, but naturally sweet wine. Yes. Uh, the rosé and then the four street naturally sweet red. Those are the most popular ones. Those one. are the three ones that we know. Yeah, so those ones are brand new. And we yeah. don't know how long they've been in the market, in our market specifically. We saw them mm -hmm. yesterday. So yeah, here yeah, we are. Today. Yeah. <laughs> My sister cut up some licorice and some strawberries for just extra fun and stuff. Okay, let's oh. start. Which one shall we start with? Pinky. Mm -hmm. How do you mean my name? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. And. Okay, cool. Actually, hope we would do this one last. But we're gonna start with the Fall Street Wild Cola. Yay! Cool. We have our um, glasses in mind. There's a licorice. Yeah, it's not wine glasses, it's just. You know, just. I think this is supposed to be whiskey uh, Glass tumblers. Yeah. But we're using it for equal distribution. There we go. Hmm, smells nice. It does smell like cola uh, yeah. and vanilla. Mm. Vanilla tinge comes mm. out. Yeah. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, I think I'm going okay. to try and Look find the color. Look at the color. New alcohols in the shops wow. and come and do like reviews. This is yeah. so cool. It's Let like me. a oh. raspberry light cola. Wow, it is great. It looks nice. Let me know what alcohols are out there so we can try them. <laughs> that should, that be, should fun. be fun. Oh, at least that's the color for Fourth Street. Yeah, rose actually. No, this is like uh, a darker color. Like a a rose. Red. Very raspberry. Mm. Like a lighter. See, it's literally red darker than my wine, red but, nails. But definitely, I mean, lighter than a red wine, but definitely darker than a rose. Let's see if we've got this equally. Nanda's drinking hers with strawberry inside. Mm. And you've got licorice in mine. I got a licorice in mine. My sister's just drinking hers like that. I yeah, know. until until I decide to eat something. Yeah. We must see how that goes. 
Okay, why does it seem like there's more in the can now? <laughs> cheers, cheers. Yay! Cheers to what? Cheers. Cheers, guys. Let's see. Wine tasty. Okay. Um, okay, I can explain. It tastes like wine. Like wine? Yeah. It smells like cola and vanilla, but it tastes like wine. But like, not your normal red wine. It's like a... I don't want to say it's a lighter red wine. Can I tell you guys how mine tastes? Mm. Like um, a rich long coke. Okay. Well, that's a nice one, Richelon Coke. Mm. For me, it's a bit, um, it's more sour than I thought it would be. I thought it would be sweeter. Yeah, um, it's just like, like at the top of your upper, there in the mouth, you can like taste the sourness a little bit. But it's more, it has more, car you see carbon, the, the, the fizzy? It has more fizziness. Yeah, yeah. more fizz than the normal like rosé or wine yeah, so course. they're definitely going for like a cider version of that instead of like a wine for people who feel like uh, wine is a bit too much so or maybe for you just trying to expand so but this is pretty good this is I'm us. actually impressed I don't know what I thought it would taste like but it's not bad actually for a cider it's actually not bad this is a good one I can see myself having this in a cocktail glass uh, with a lot of fruit lots of fruit Yes. Okay, fine. Not lost, but like flavored or what do you call that? Garnished. Garnished with a few fruits. I'm just drinking because strawberry, raspberry. How does, how, does the, how does the how does the licorice make it taste? Nothing. Doesn't. You really don't think? No. Nope. Don't you? Strawberry. Nothing. Hi, <laughs> Paul. Mm. Cheers, guys. It's nice though. I like it. I like the glass. I'm gonna add some licorice. Just to hopefully see. Actually, I'm mm. gonna go for both. I'll do licorice and strawberry. I think that would have been nice with the with the raspberry flavor. Which one? The uh, 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 the strawberry. No, I'm gonna have it. Like I'm gonna chew it after the end of the and also see and then with the other one I'm gonna add something else. <coughs> um, how much is this thing gonna cost? The six pack oh. was seventy nine. Oh. Yeah, $79.95 I think and we found it in the pick and pay liquor shop in Vernier. Yeah. No, I'm blind. I thought it was $74. Uh, no, yeah, it's less than but it's less than 80 yeah. bucks. Yeah, but it's there. We don't know how much the individual six ones. Six pack, 440 cans, 440 mils, six pack cans. Yeah, not your normal, no, normal 330 mils. Yeah, so hopefully it's pretty good actually. I'm very impressed by this. I like this one. Okay. Just a bit. Hmm? Sure. Oh, okay. Mm. Mm. And? Does it make it... Okay, oh. finish yours. Under <laughs> pressure. I'll finish everything. I'm going to put the onion a little bit for tasting. Hmm? Yeah, I think better next time. And the thing I like about I think this one compared to other ciders is that it's so lightweight that you don't feel like you are becoming full like you've eaten something or like you know when you're the feeling you you get when you drink like a lot of juice or like hunters or beer those type tricks you. It doesn't give you that type of feeling at all. It's like very like lightweight in the how it makes you feel. Yeah. So you can get away with like it's one of those ciders I feel like especially this one the fizziness gives it a little bit of class especially for the ladies. I think this is a very lady drink. Like if you have like a Saturday brunch with the girls and you want to have something alcoholic, I think this is going to be something that you could actually consider. Th that's my personal opinion. Makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Nice cocktail glass. Nice cocktail. Or you just want to hang out with the girls one night, one evening. Especially if you are hosting an event, this would be a nice welcoming drink actually. You know at the door how people mm. do like the, the, the juice and the fruit? You can actually do this. Like on the, when they do the champagne, non-alcoholic champagne at the door. Yeah. You can also then use one, one of this to do that. I don't know if the, I don't know how many you're going to use though for like those beautiful champagne glasses. But anyway, it's just for taste so when minutes. people come in into an event, these are very nice ones. I don't know if I'll, 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 
I will um, advise people to get the wild cola one yet. Not yet. Don't know. Not yet. I'll give you, we'll give you our final. I'll compare the other ones. So we we'll see which one is our favorite one. But this one is pretty good for now. For cola. Esquisto. If you like. I think we're going to we're going to grade this at the end of all the tasting out of five names okay. and like see which ones we like better. So like a you know when you start type of thing out of five with taste the whole color and the whole flavor of whatever it makes you feel and how it tastes when you add a little bit of extra garnish. Just remember all those things as I get to the end. That's good. Agreed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. Do you taste? <laughs> <laughs> So you must think about it now already. Okay. okay. Think about it, ne? So that you have it sort of hopefully at the back of your mind, and yeah. you don't forget. Hopefully. So hopefully the other stuff don't get you too excited. Because we started them at the end, we're just gonna go and then and into the last one. So. Oh okay. This thing makes you burp really nice for all your who likes burping. I'm sorry. Very lady like. Um. Uh, now we're gonna try the rocking raspberry. <laughs> it's pink. And this is the what? What? Uh, what does it contain again? What was it, my 4.5? Mm -hmm. Is it raspberry nichi? Oh, mm. 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 what a combination! Being very ladylike, show your nails. So pretty. So they're pretty long. She can't. I'm not gonna show you mine. They're a little bit embarrassing. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Why this one is this? very light. Can you buy a Anyway, this one is very light. It looks like a rosé. Uh, yeah, that that looks not like a rosé. Yeah, rosé color almost. Mmm, raspberry and lychee. Okay. Maybe that's the lychee that's taking out the extra red. Mm. You can smell the lychee. Mm. You can smell it already. Mm. Yes, yeah, true. It's funny how you can taste the underlining like flavors in within the wine, the cider. So this is how it looks like. Yeah, very light rosé, has that very nice uh, fuzziness that makes you think of of sparkling wine. I love sparkling wine, so this is already the winner in that regard. Uh. The lychee really comes out. Oh, strong. look at how pretty her is. Look oh, at that. that looks pretty. Oh, wow. And the strawberries. That's so cute. See, oh. you can always like flavor the so thing up. Pretty. Cheers. Cheers, okay. guys. To the new flavors. Mmm. Mmm, smells nice. Mmm. Okay. It's very light. It's, it's quite this is very people who don't like sugar name. This is like mm -hmm. this is the one. This is the one. Mm. And you can definitely smell the lychee in here, mm -hmm. but you can't taste the lychee, which is very interesting because it's very like like I said. I think I said this before. You can you can smell the underlining ingredient, yeah. but you can, that's not you the taste really, that you get immediately. You like taste you taste the wineness of it. Mm. You know that whole wine comes across quite strong. Taste wise, but smell wise, you definitely smell the lychee. But it's good, it smells amazing. Yeah. It looks cool, it looks very cool. This is now for the girls who feel like I don't want to have something strong, I want to have something that seems light. I think this may be it. Looks good. Mm. It's like there's a flavor that I'm, I'm like tasting, but. No, 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 come on. Yeah, there's a taste that somehow reminds me of JC Leroux in this thing. But I'm trying to figure out which bottle of JC Leroux actually reminds me of this. The white one. The white one. But there's one. like the white JC Leroux. There's like yep. just yep. a tinge. The white JC Leroux. The white JC Leroux uh, sparkling wine. That's this one. That's for sure. Yeah, the red one, the wild cola. I think that whole sparkling wineness comes out, which is actually that's what, I, as I said, I think previously, it's one of my favorite actually uh, aspects of this uh, of this little you know, ciders. I'm assuming we can call it ciders. I, I think they are. Yeah, I yeah. think they are ciders now. Ciders. Well, they're in a can. Does it mean something is in a can? It's a cider. I assume so. 
wouldn't it? Or beer. Beer is also in a, in a can. Oh. I know, but beer I is not a cider. But beer is beer. Beer has got so much. Yeah, I didn't finish so fast. Because <sighs> this is like. This is not the drink that you drink if you wanna go out and like really like be turned. This is just for like what starters? Yeah, I'm feeling good. Like feel yeah, that's it. I don't know what like this pre drinks? Would you drink this for pre drinks you think? No, this is when the day that I don't wanna drink alcohol. Hi but this is like it is alcoholic. <laughs> I know. But the way that it tastes that's what I'm saying. It's, that's what I was saying. It's this deceiving. will get you drunk if you're not careful because it's so like it's deceiving. It is so deceiving. It will feel good. You'll just be drinking like three, four cans. Next thing you know, you are like in a bar. Tell us what you think. Mm -mm -mm -mm. It's difficult to tell. You don't like this one. All I can say, you want to do classic. Classic is this one. <laughs> Strawberry. Strawberries. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, Minanda, you really look so nice with this like whole situation. Yeah, and then it comes out. Doesn't you doesn't you remind you what is the the the, the Egyptian movie that the Cleopatra? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think it's the fringe. The fringe yeah. that Cleopatra the look. Hair anyway. Yeah. How do you guys like my afro? It is not the best, I'm sorry, it's the middle of the night. Yeah. Okay. okay. Almost middle of the night. I don't know, eleven ish. Mm. Oh yeah. Two eleven. Okay. Good yeah. yeah. Like at the top of this is like pajamas, so this video that is no makeup. Well, it's a home life. Anyway. Oh, okay. this is so lightweight, girl. Mm -hmm. not even it is, but you can go feel the kick a little bit. You can feel that. Mm -hmm. I think it's the sparkliness, guys. That sparkle. A lot of people will say, come on, the sparkle. There's a whole thing why sparkling wine is so potent. Mm -hmm. The bubbles make you drunk. Gonna be true. <laughs> just the bubbles. Okay, fine. It's not just them. Of course, if it's just little myths, man. It's not like a, uh, a proven fact. Um, it's just people's opinions. All right, cool. Mm. Next, Miss Nanda's. Oh my word. Cool button. What? But the what? Cool botanical. Cool botanical. Cool botanical mixed with. Cucumber and juniper. Mm -hmm. Yes, ready, ready. Get it. Sounds like you're going to have an ASMR moment in your life. Like that. Oh, yeah. oh wow. Mm. What is an ASMR You know when people do those things where they don't talk, they just be here chewing them. Like into the mic and do papers and like scratch and people enjoy those things. As well as things. Oh, it's definitely, much. I can hear it. Oh, mm. can be an mm. ASMR moment. That's a nice song. Oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna come closer so that we can hopefully hear this. Okay, okay. Mm. Getting carried away. Let's see. Okay. Okay, I can smell the cucumber. Oh. Since I don't know why the jumi ju botanical ju 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 juniper juniper botanical scents. It's on flow. What's on the flow? Botanical is supposed to be like a garden. Right. Yeah. Like. Yeah. This already smells healthy. It does smell like a cucumber. <laughs> it literally oh, smells like a cucumber. Okay, cheers, guys. Oh, cheers. Mm. Okay. That whole mm -hmm. that thing comes out again. This reminds me of Acha. Acha. Okay. Acha is a cider. There was a there was a time when Acha was a cider. I think it's still a cider. It's still a cider. Arches Aqua. That's all I remember. Yeah, Arches Aqua. So this here, the cool botanical reminds me of Arches Aqua because of the. It literally gives you, I think, what the others are supposed to give you, like all the. 
it's about it smells like a garden i think that's why it smells like a garden in a like uh winter like you know how nice flowers and everything it's supposed to smell like that like a fruit salad ah. <laughs> <laughs> i'm really really just getting a heck of a lot of even cucumber. the taste is very like for me the taste is like i don't want to say bland but it's so healthy <laughs> just if healthy had the smell <laughs> yes it's not bland, but I don't know how to explain it. I like it. I think I like all of them. Okay. Ooh, that looks cool. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm going to put, put strawberry in it. Ah! Wow, wow. Licorice. Mm. I don't know what it will do, but I'm hoping it does something. Maybe it will do something to the licorice Some and not to the wine. It's not doing anything to the color, that's for sure. It's a natural Wait, sign. it is. It's changing. Yours is a bit darker, so. Yeah, no, mine is darker. Mm -hmm. Okay, so licorice mm -hmm. is being attacked. That should mean, hopefully, that it's leaving some flavor. I don't know if you guys can see it. There you are. And. Someone needs to put some sugar in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is for the healthy conscious, clearly. Yeah, it's I like think a, when you want to drink alcohol, but you want to be healthy and you don't want to feel guilty about it, like, doesn't it say this is the one. Of and you also want to be classy or slightly licks, as they say in Afrikaans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? Sugar. No sugar nothing. added, nothing. Mm -hmm. It says nothing. Mm -hmm. Well, there is no. Mm, nothing. No dietary references made here whatsoever. Mm -hmm. We don't know the amount of sugar in here. Finest quality, go for. No, really? What is that? <laughs> That's the finest quality, go for. All right. <laughs> That's all it says. Okay. okay, we don't know nothing. Well, it's grapes. It's healthy. It's cucumber. And Google what? What? What is the, the botanical thing? Juniper. Mm. Yeah, that's my phone. Mm. Let's go. Let me get my phone quick. Juniper. Botanical. Okay, fine. I'll just Google juniper first, and then mm -hmm. juniper. Mm. Juniper berry. It's a berry. Mm. A juniper berry is the female seed cone produced by the various species of junipers. Which is a... It is not a true berry, but a cone mm -hmm. with unusually fleshy and merged scales, which gives it a berry-like appearance. This is Wikipedia. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me just... I mustn't go for juniper berry. Let me just go for juniper. Plants. Juniper. Okay. So juniper plants are a coniferous, okay, junipers are coniferous trees and shrubs in the genus Juniperus of the Cypress oh. family. Cupressaceous, uh-uh. Cypress? <clears throat> it's just Cupressaceae, hopefully. And the image of it? Depending on the bloody blah, 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 blah. I'll, blah, I'll blah, put in an image blah. of what they say mm -hmm. the plant looks mm -hmm. like. And what the berries actually look like? They look like a black, like a black Ooh, gray. They are pretty. Oh, they look. Mm. Some of them look blue. Ooh. Wow. How do I do this now? Yeah, I'll, I'll, almost look oh. like blueberries. Oh, can you see? No, no you can't see it. I'll, Sorry. I'll insert a picture of what they what they oh. look like. No, now I've got a clue. Okay. They look like blueberries. So they are so pretty. Oh, grapes, but, oh, but then they are oh, oh, no. berries. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, so supposedly they look like berries, but they are not mm. actually berries. No one. They are just cones. Okay. But they are very pretty cones. Botanical. I've seen someone with a tree like that. So do juniper, but juniper, whatever botanical. Juniper botanical. So I would oh. assume that it's like all the juniper seeds together. I mean juniper berries. Botanical. Botanical. Juniper botanical. Yep. 
Can you find gin? Gin. Oh. Hmm? Ooh. So juniper is also used in gin. Amazing. So it's just juniper plants in a nursery. Mm. In a nursery, yeah, makes yeah. it botanical, yeah, okay. So all the juniper seeds all together. Or berries, juniper berries. If together. this is the juniper, whatever, then maybe like mixes why this will make gin. What do you mean why this will make gin? So we have ferment for it. Okay, it will make gin. The important gin botanical that makes gin gin. This is what makes gin gin. Hey, the juniper botanical. They are so pretty. Blue. <laughs> anyway, so I like I like this one because it has blueberries, blue juniper berries in it. Mm. Oh. You guys have a favorite in mind? Already. Um, yeah, I think I have a favorite already. Uh -oh. But my battery is flashing. Quickly gonna change while we think about our responses, the batteries, and then we're gonna come back and then we're gonna give our final review of the Sia, the ciders, and with the Which one is our favorite? Change our favorites, should you try them, flavors, all of that stuff. We'll be back in like a jiffy. We're back. Batteries changed. Now we're gonna give you our final reviews. <sighs> Hey guys, do you want some more? Yes. While well, you think. Yes. Do you want this one or that one? I'll mix, mix them. Wow! Um, even lighter. Okay, cool. You already have a favorite in mind? Not yet. What? I'm, going, I'm going for the second time. That one, this one is empty. And then for the last, I'm going to combine all three of them. So then you can make all of them. All of them is fine. I'm going to ask next one. This two that we have left. Like, 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 that for me is easy. These two of me are the like. Complicação. Okay, fine. Yeah, sound. All right, we're gonna give our review, <laughs> and then <laughs> if, if we, hold on, guys. <laughs> if we have a consensus mm. as to which one is our favorite, then we'll have that one as the last drink. I thought we said we must mix it for you. But you, you're confusing me. <laughs> I'm sure this is not recommended by the people who made this to mix them, but. Please do not mix. With okay. This thing. Let's. Ooh. Yeah, don't mix them. It's not so bad actually. It's like like that. <laughs> um, just like everything just faded. Hey, One of them is much stronger than the other. All the flavors. The botanical. Faded. Botanical is so much stronger than the rocking raspberry. Okay, let's start. Okay, cool. You do, have, do you already have a favorite? I have a favorite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You made up your mind? Mm -hmm. Can we start now? Yeah. Who do we start with? Summer. Okay. <laughs> what is your favorite? I think hands down, my favorite is the wild color. Oh, wow. No, I didn't think you would think that, but okay. Why See? not? I don't know. Well, I didn't think you would think that. But why not? I don't know. No, the, it was the, for me. It's the best taste-wise. It tasted like wine. If I like, I say a sort of lighter version of a red wine, and like a merlot, even a naturally sweet but milder version. That smell comes out of the vanilla and coke. I like that very much. Uh, I think that's one of the ones that I would definitely choose if I should have three drinks. If I just want to chill, if I'm out on, on a brunch, definitely. Uh, second one uh, is the Rocky Raspberry. That's the da, one. I, da, yeah. Mm -hmm. And the one that I unfortunately like least is the Cool Botanical. It's not. I think this is something about it though. It's not. It doesn't catch you the okay. same way that the Wild Cola did. Okay. This is. This one is really like like we say that whole healthy vibe. If you if you feel like. You know, me, I'm watching my what's supposed to make yourself feel good or whatever. Low calories. Low calories or even though there's no dietary references or, or, or uh, things noted on the can. 
that's the one you should go for. You should, you will definitely do a good bunch of them. Okay. That's my view. Okay. Your favorite. You know, with the with the wild color, it was very easy to detect because for me personally, it tasted like Richello. Blended with Coca-Cola and then these two the raspberry and the cool botanical botanical it's so confusing guys but I know raspberry have got the strong uh, flavor for me mm -hmm. something something about it that is just you know popping out so you like the raspberry better raspberry since I love JC <laughs> I'll go for cool. What? Yes. I, I, okay, I, I, I didn't expect that. Oh, I don't like rich low mixed with coke. Hi, <laughs> Bo. Please comment Konya. below Konya. and let me know about uh, wild, wild cola. Wild you cola. tell me it tastes like rich and Coca Cola, and you'll be like, tasty little. There's someone to go. Okay. <laughs> I think both of them actually surprised me. I thought, anyway, let me first give you my, and then I'll tell you what I thought they would choose. Okay. My favorite one is like hands down, mm -hmm. the cool botanical. What? Is my favorite one simply because I can see myself mixing it with something else uh -huh. to create like a cool cocktail. So, but like mix, mixer, it is like a very, very cool mixer. Like, Cider. Oh, it's almost a surprise. Yeah. Yeah, because she thought I'd like the rice, the rocking rice. No, thing. actually, no. I thought I would like the cola. cola. No. For some reason. Uh uh. Oh, no. wow. I like this one. Although it needs to, a little bit of sugar. Like, someone needs to add more. Just. But this is what, like, this one, like. Wait, it's here. Wait. You, both of you like the same one? Mm -hmm. Yes. We both like the uh, cool botanical. I like that how it like really makes me feel make, make me feel of a, a, a salad bowl, a fruit salad bowl. I it's like the fact that we're talking about <laughs> It's literally like walking by in or in a garden when like in spring when everything is blooming. That that smell like yeah. that one. Okay, that's cool. It's really cool. I think it's, it's yeah. But if you don't like if you like sugar, you will not like this one because it'll be too dry for you. Um, oh yeah. Right the, the wild cola does not give me the Richello flavor like her. <laughs> so like we cognac know, and coke, like what she's it. saying. Okay, so let us know if you try this, mm -hmm. what you think about our, the flavors, and which one is your favorite? And which one is your favorite? I think you probably like wild cola. <laughs> Uh, I'm actually, I actually think most people would like the rock and raspberry. I actually thought she would like the botanical, and I thought why she would, would, like would like the, the rock and raspberry. Botanical. I don't know why, because the cola is so, it's so, it just catches you off guard because it's cola. It's so <coughs> for a wine, it catches you off guard. I can, okay, fine. Guys, yeah, comment okay. below and let us know what you think. Yeah, okay. so, I, I don't actually, I don't, I think I'm surprised. You know, honestly. Ms. Nanda, I actually thought mm -hmm. you would like the raspberry one. I don't know why, but I think yes, because it's, it's sort of light-ish. No, no, no. I thought you would like that. I thought you would actually like the wild cola because you like red wine mm -hmm. so much, and that one is sort of the closest one to red wine. I'm very surprised. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Like the botanical one. <laughs> After the comments that they had said while they were drinking it, it's so healthy. No, 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 no. I thought that was like going to be the yeah, least it, favorite. It's just picking up, okay, among the three. Like, yeah, I can. Anyway, that's our favorite and that's our review. If I had to go out and buy them, I'll definitely buy the botanical. And then, if they don't have, then I'll go for the raspberry. But I will never go into the shop and first and think wild cola. Mm. I, I didn't think I would like it. Okay, that's the whole truth. I actually, I don't know what I expected from the wild cola. I thought that I would most likely like the botanical yeah. and the raspberry one. Uh, that's what I thought. Because they're the ones that look closest to what 4th Street actually produces. Mm. Yeah. This one, the, the wild cola one, is like completely, completely different flavor 
from what they give us normally yeah so i actually thought i would like those two and if i should like anyone better i would most likely go for the raspberry one that's what mm. i thought uh -huh. but then the wild cola one gives me the more red winey taste that i'm after compared to the raspberry one which is very rosé and i'm not I don't, I don't like rosé so much anymore and uh, i haven't had white wine in such a long time actually because i prefer the red one but still the botanical you know honestly i think i would also give it I don't know where I will stand with it, you know, honestly. It's not that I don't like it as such, but it's just not. It's not going to be my first choice. But it was it can it can be my second, that's for sure, compared because of the fact that I don't actually like rose as such. Yeah. Yeah. If you had to walk into the shop. But I think it's the cucumber part is the one that actually probably will be. Because I'm like thinking I'm out, I would like to have a drink. Why must I think of cucumbers? Oh, it's not the drink that I would buy when I go out. Like, let's not get that. Like, that's what I'm saying. If you wanna get turned up, this is not the. This is not. It will never be one of my top ones that I pick for turned up. This is very like Sunday brunch. I don't wanna drink alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> this is my version of. I don't wanna drink today, but I want something light. That will be the one. It's nice. It's a very lady like drink. drink, I think. Nanda. Yeah. God. If it's your first time, please don't forget to subscribe. Oh, comment oh. and like. Oh, okay. Don't forget that. Don't forget. If it's your first time, please subscribe, like, and comment. Comment below, guys. Oh God, my sister's channel. Yay! Well, they're actually closing off the channel. Well, that's our review. Uh, let us know if there are other drinks that. You Let's start with side dress first. Let's not go very expensive. This is like Corona time. Let's just Jeez, do like things real. that you think you want us to try, and we'll try and get those. And yeah, yeah, and review. So, yeah, that would be fun. So we'll try and review a few of the drinks. We'll, we must actually, I think we must review the the Bernini, the Bernini flavors that they have. It's a different flavor. Uh, actually, I think so we must try that. I don't know if you guys remember Esprit. Yes, oh, yeah. Esprit also has mm. ciders now, also in cans, oh. and they've got like different flavors as well. I think I've seen three we'll, flavors. We'll go look out for those flavors and then like film another video um, reviewing those, and it'll be like our Friday for you going for the people going out. It'll be like one of those series trying on alcohol, so you can try them when you do decide to go out. Please don't forget to social distance and to keep yeah. yourself safe, wear your masks and all of that stuff. Like they say, don't forget to like, comment and then subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends so we can make it grow. Um, that's it from us. Thank Peace. you so much for watching. Wear your mask, sanitize, social distance as mentioned. Yeah, we are together because we're in the same household. That's the reason we don't have masks on. So don't think that we are like against <laughs> <laughs> all of that stuff so yeah that's it from us i thank you so much for watching let me know what you think about this video did you like it was it fun for you something different i think it is something different i like this anyway thank you so much i'll see you guys in my next video don't know what it's gonna be i guess i'll surprise you again yay <laughs>